Este video es presentado por el Sistema Ciencia Garza Educativa de la Universidad Autónoma del Estado de Hidalgo. Para mayor información, visítanos en www.uaeh.edu.mx. Gracias por aprender. Hello, everybody. Um... I am teacher Arcy and I work in the high school number five located in Itzlahuaco. My uh, today we're going to talk about actions happening in the moment. Actually, uh, what are the things or what are the actions that we are doing to protect our planet? Okay, as you can visualize here in the screen, we have a quote. There is a, wonder, uh, there is a wonderful saying that it says, we are living on this planet as if we have another one to go. Well, uh, I, need your, um, I need that you guys take some minutes to read this phrase and also to consider uh, some of the beliefs that you have about our planet. Okay, nice opinions. Well, we're going to check this other one. This is also, that is in short words, but also is very important because it says, there is no planet B. And uh, according to these quotes, uh, what we need to do is to make conscience and how or what are the actions that we are doing to protect our planet you see so now uh, some of the people used to uh, recycle different things or maybe they are uh, doing ecological actions to protect our planet right so in this moment we're going to analyze some of the activities that I am doing to protect our planet. Pay attention to them, okay? But first, think about it. Think about the actions or the, uh, and the activities that we're doing to protect our planet. Well, as you can visualize in this part, uh, there are different activities, right? Could you please mention some of them? For example, what do you consider in this part that uh, there is a bicycle? Or for example, everybody, what do you consider about the picture in which there is a bag? There is an ecological bag. Have you ever used ecological bags? All right, we're going to check them. Number one, I am using the bike. Yes, believe it or not, I don't have any car. I really like to do a lot of exercise. And most important, what I really like is to protect our planet. So for that reason, I am using the bike, okay? To go to my work at home and so on. Number two, well, I guess that uh, nowadays, most of the people have any um, ecological bag at home. So, uh, in my case, I am also using ecological bags to go to the supermarket, to go to uh, buy different fruits or different products. The next one. Okay. Um, this is something that I really do during the day because I really like to uh, turn off the lights when they are not needed, you see? So this is the action, okay? Turning off the lights, good. The other, well, this is something that most of the people also uh, tend to, to do, okay? We uh, recycle, well, in my case, I am recycling, for example, papers, and also I like to recycle magazines or any other uh, object that I can use in another things, okay? So now, 
Okay, and remember everybody that if we want to express an action, or in this case, several actions that we are doing nowadays or, a specific, or at a specific moment, we need to use this tense, the present continuous, you see? Well, here, if you can observe in the first column, we have the people, okay? Remember, I, you, for example, you, uh, uh, Mayra, you, Katia, you, Mario, okay? And the next one, remember that we have a, a special group of people that is called the third person. I mean, he, she, or it, you see? For example, here I have, if you can uh, observe in this picture, here we, ha here we have a boy. So a boy is represented by the, na the pronoun he. Well, pay attention to this table. In this table, we can have an idea that is an object, you see? So uh, this table is represented by the pronoun it. And finally, if you can visualize in this picture, we have different people, you see? But especially the lady in this um, who is wearing pink color, well, this person is represented by the pronoun she, okay? They are our three people. And also, there we have the pronoun we. Remember that we is when we are included, okay? In a group of people, maybe my family, okay? I am included in that part. You, and finally they, as you can observe in this part, okay? They, I mean the students, and also, the teacher, okay? Well, once that we remember all of these aspects, the second important part of each one of them is to use the correct uh, verb to be for each person, okay? I am, you are, he, she, it, is, we, you, and they are, you see? For example, pay attention in the affirmative uh, in the affirmative part, well, as you can observe, we have this picture, okay? What is the action that all of them are doing? Well, they are playing, okay? They are playing, good. So, in my case, I am playing, you are playing, she is playing, he is playing, you see? And of course, they are playing. So if we want to uh, change all of these affirmative aspects into a negative one, we need to modify only the verb to be. The verb to be, the easiest thing to do it, okay, is to add in not to the verb to be. I'm not, aren't, or isn't, okay? Remember that they are the short forms aren't or isn't. And finally, in the interrogative part, what we need to do is only change, okay? As you can see, in the affirmative aspect, there is, I am playing, okay? To do this, um, to have a question, we need to change only the order between my auxiliar, that is the verb to be, and the person. I am playing, so in this case, am I, playing, and remember to give the intonation to have into sound like a question, okay? And uh, if you can uh, see at the end of the slide, it says, remember the present continuous is to describe an action which is happening now, okay? At the moment of speaking or maybe nowadays, during, the, uh, during these days, you see? Okay, so if you can observe in the table, there is, okay, some of the actions that I do. Well, pay attention to this picture that is on the screen. There are uh, different people, you see? So what do you imagine that they are doing to protect our planet? Nice opinions, okay. Excellent. They are planting trees, okay? 
This is a really nice idea, everybody, because we need to protect our planet. We need to have a lot of trees to have a natural oxygen. The next one. Okay, everybody tell me, are they eating tacos in that moment? No, actually, yes. Uh, no, they aren't, right? Because, but uh, they are doing another ecological action to protect our planet. Well, could you please tell me, everybody, think in a moment, what are they doing at the moment? I don't know if you have heard about this word that is um, to use full cars, okay? So, uh, this activity uh, is mainly used in Mexico City. I used to live in Mexico City like two years, okay, two years ago. And what we do is, for example, have you ever heard also about the Uber? Well, in the Uber, there is a car that different people can, um, can use, can take to get to a place, to another place, okay? To another common place. So that is the part when we can also save our planet. Okay, also related to the, to the uh, picture that was uh, in the last slide, there, uh, there were different opinions that you may think about it, okay? For example, I, uh, in my case, I consider that they, uh, that they are using a pool car, but maybe some of you uh, may mention that they are having fun because all of the people were smiling, right? Or that Albert is drinking soda. Another activity or another action that you may mention was that Mario is feeling so, so happy. Another one is that Susan is taken by phone. I don't know if you really pay attention, but the girl, the only girl who was in the car, in the red car, it was Susan, and she's uh, talking by the phone, okay? Maybe she's talking by the phone with her mom, or with her boyfriend, or maybe a friend, okay? And the next one is that Cesar is driving a red car, yes? So in this moment, we know uh, who is the people uh, in that car, all right? So, okay, could you guys uh, think some minutes? Help me to, uh, to write it down, complete ideas about the words that we have on the screen. For example, it says, don't contaminate, rivers, sea, and ocean. You see? So attention, in the people we have, uh, in the picture we have different people, okay? So we don't know exactly who are they, so we can say like, they, and the second point, this is an action that is in the negative form, you see? So they aren't, aren't contaminating rivers, See, and the ocean, you see? Okay. Perfect, this is uh, what I was explaining. They are not, remember, this is a negative uh, sentence, so we need to modify the number two, the verb to be in the negative form, okay? They are not contaminating Remember, this action is happening nowadays, so we need to modify the ending, okay? We, uh, they are not contaminating rivers, sea, and ocean. You see? Great, everybody. Now, uh, write it down your sentence. Okay, now that we discuss all of these activities, all of these actions, could you please tell me, everybody, okay, to make a list about all the actions, okay, that you are doing to protect the planet. Remember, everybody, to uh, use the vocabulary that we learned today. For example, ecological bags, use a bike, don't contaminate, uh, and so on, okay? Okay. 
Well, everybody, that's everything for today's lesson. I hope that you have uh, learned something new today. And remember to make a list about the things that you are doing nowadays to protect our planet. Thank you so much.